Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany. And if this is your first time stumbling across one of my videos, I usually focus on fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, fragrances, and pretty much whatever else I feel like talking about. So if that seems like something that you may be interested in, go ahead and click on that subscribe button if you enjoy the content, of course. Also, if you're already a subscriber, go ahead and click on that notification bell so that you do not miss an upload from me. Today's video, we're gonna be focusing on black owned businesses and black owned businesses only, okay? Every single year, Year, I do a roundup of some of my favorite things that I love from black owned businesses and what better month to do it in the month of black history month so let's go ahead and get started so let's start off with makeup the first product I have to talk about and I think it's my only makeup product here it is from pound cake okay this is my favorite red lipstick anytime you see me in a red lip I'm wearing pound cake more than likely. And one of my favorite colors from them is red velvet. But guys, I have recently discovered a new color. They did send me over some new colors. This one is in red bean. Red bean is more of a classic blue red. Um, red velvet, I would say, is more of a bright blue red. And I like a bright red lip. But this red bean is so good. I actually wore this on Valentine's Day. And you guys were asking me about the lip color because it was so rich and so beautiful. I'll insert a clip here so you guys can see it it is every single thing number one first of all pound cake is known for having the perfect red lip it doesn't matter what your lip color is your skin tone they are going to have a perfect red shade for you and I love the fact that these lipsticks go on with one swipe and they're super opaque but they're also not drying to the lips that is super important because if you're wearing a red lip especially a liquid lip over time you'll notice sometimes your lips start to crack or the lipstick is cracking and it makes your lips look kind of you know just kind of gross you don't have to worry about that with pound cake even though they do dry down to I would say more of a semi matte finish you don't get that like cracking of your lipstick so your lips are always looking hydrated and plump and nice so that's why I love them but also again the one swipe I don't have to use a ton of product to get it right usually I line my lips and then I just go over this with one swipe top and bottom and I'm good to go for hours, okay? And I don't have to worry about reapplying this throughout the day. It is absolutely amazing. If you haven't already, you need to be checking out Pound Cake. They are available at Ulta and I will also link them down below and you can use my code to get some money off as well, okay? But they are absolutely amazing. I know on my last video that I spoke about them, a lot of you said that you've tried them and you love them. So I'm super happy that this is a black owned business, woman owned business on top of that and they're available at Ulta. We love to hear it. So thank you Pound Cake for sending over my favorite red, which is red velvet in a couple of new ones for me to try super excited that I have been able to add two more reds to my arsenal and, and before we move into the next category this dress that I'm wearing is by Jordan Woods another black owned brand so if you want to support that I'll make sure to have this one linked down below she um, has been around for a year and this was like their one year anniversary design for the dresses she's known for just like bodycon dresses but I really did enjoy the design of this one and how bright and blue this dress is I'm usually not a blue girl like this but I thought this was popping and it looks so good on our skin tone. Okay, so I definitely wanted to get that out the way just in case you guys were wondering where this dress is from. It is so cute. Next up, I wanna talk about some body oils and like candles. Um, I'm gonna save the accessories for last because I have more of that. First off, I have this body oil here. It is so sleek. The packaging is so cute. This is by the Black Candle Company. OMG, I discovered them only a week ago, y'all, and I'm already hooked, okay? They have candles, they have body sprays uh, slash room sprays. Um, because they're natural, you can use them on your body. They have oils, they have uh, diffusers, they have all the things, okay? So at this summit that I was speaking at, they had these oils sitting out and the candles. And when I walked by, I smelled this amazing scent. I was like, what is that? Y'all, I ended up buying like four or five things. But the main thing that I wanna talk about is the oil. The reason why I love this oil, this one is in Black Rose. They have an, a few others. My sister bought some. Um, I bought a couple, but Black Rose is the one that I really want to focus on today. Um, Black Rose is a beautiful, sweet, kind of like I don't know. It's a black rose. It smells so good, but it's not too mature in my opinion. Um, it kind of gives you that Delina vibe, you know, um, 
just a beautiful rose scent. So on their website, it says black rose exudes pink peppercorn, grapefruit, plum, black rose, cumin, vanilla, patchouli, and labdanum. Envision a rich floral fragrance. And that's exactly what it is. It's like a sweet, deep rose but again it doesn't lean too mature but anybody can wear this kind of gives delina vibes i like how it's uplifted with that grapefruit that peppercorn gives it a little bit of spice um but it's pink peppercorn so you know it's not as heavy on the spice it's just every single thing and the reason why these oils stand out number one the price point you get this one ounce for ten dollars i think that is amazing uh deal and it also has a dropper i don't want to spill it all over myself but i love the price point on this and also you guys this oil is so potent it is so potent i can smell it through the bottle right now and the reason why these oils are so potent is because you can make your own body butters with this you can make your own candles with this oil you can make your own diffusers it is just endless what you can do some of the oils that you may purchase like perfume oils or just scented oils in general they're not as potent because they're meant to just be for your body or you know whatever have you this oil is so potent you only need a little bit you guys oh my goodness but it projects like no other they do have this in a larger size too i want to say it's a four ounce or an eight ounce still not too expensive they have a ton of candles all the things i am obsessed with black rose you need to get it and they do have a website but this is a nashville local company and i love that for me because it's really nice to be able to go into a place um, it's very luxurious it's appointment only you can go in you can shop and um you know it exudes black luxury and i love that for us now this i hadn't opened yet but i did pick up a melt a wax melt warmer and i don't know why it's so difficult to find a nice sleek wax melt warmer okay i've looked all over amazon all over the internet i can't find anything just super sleek and just simple everything looks like a little lamp or just something and i'm just like that's not really what i'm looking for and that's actually what made me stop by this booth because i saw this i was like omg i've been looking for something like this and it was very inexpensive and this is it how sleek is this y'all i love the fact that it has this push button to turn it on super easy to use you just plug it in and you're good to go like I think this is so cute, so sleek, and I love the fact that it's black. And it's super inexpensive as well. I believe $22 or $32, not crazy at all. They also have this waterless diffuser on there as well. I was going to get that, but I was like, you know what? I've been looking for one of these for a while. So I decided to go ahead and just pick this up and I love it. And of course I had to pick up some wax melts and this is what they look like. Love the packaging on this. And this one is in the scent Black Ambiance. Again, 100% natural and cruelty free. So for Black Ambiance, it says it's a white tea and fig scent. It exudes green floral notes and freshly steeped white and green tea. Envision stepping into the W Hotel. And if you know me, you know I love the W and this smells just like the W, okay? So had to grab this. Like, of course, I want my home to smell like a luxurious hotel. But again, black owned business, uh, Nashville based. And I just love that for us. So that's what I picked up. I picked up two oils. Um, one is in Black Woman. I like that one, but I'm getting used to it. I wanted to really mention Black Rose, though, because I've literally been wearing it every single day since I picked this up. And that is not like me because I have a ton of fragrances. Um, but this mixes so well with so many things. Like I wore this yesterday with Bianca latte girl today i'm headed out to an event and i'm wearing it with bianco latte and say noir from beyonce like but this oil just really projects like you don't need much okay excellent black rose now speaking of my home smelling amazing you guys i could not make a video without mentioning scented hibiscus okay this is one of their candles this is in Vanilla Supreme. Um, it's a luxe coconut apricot cream wax and it has vanilla and cashmere is the scent. This smells so luxe. This is not like a regular old vanilla smell. It's definitely giving vanilla cashmere. You guys know I've been in my gourmand era, so I love vanilla. I've used this you can't even tell. I've used this and it melts so evenly and so nice. This is one of the ones that I was currently burning, but I have several of their candles and I use them and love them. But what I really want to talk about are the new linen and room sprays and the diffusers. 
let me tell you something top notch okay top notch so these are the room and linen sprays how luxe is this packaging you guys i am obsessed with these okay so i have the scents evening bloom and midnight hour omg midnight hour kind of gives black rose not gonna lie it's like that rosy deep scent that i love i love my home to smell very fresh and floral and you know stuff like that but the reason why I want to talk about these is because they last forever. Like I don't expect much out of a room spray. I enjoy using room and linen sprays as a refresher. You know, I'm expecting 30 minutes to an hour of, you know, sillage or whatever you want to call it. But um, with these, I'm telling you, 24 hours later, I'm able to smell these. I sprayed this one in my guest bathroom and somebody was just like, what in the world is that smell? I'm like, nothing i don't have anything in there I have regular soap hand soap in there like nothing in there is like giving off any scent and i had to think back like omg i used this in the bathroom and it was still scented up y'all this midnight hour goes crazy okay and evening bloom is amazing as well it's more of a fresher scent i love this definitely will be using this more in the spring i use this in my bedroom right now and i love the fact that they have the notes on the side okay so the notes for midnight hour is rose plum vanilla peppercorn and sandalwood that makes sense right omg it's like literally the same thing as black rose love that this smells so, so, so good. You could probably use this as a body mist or a fragrance if you really wanted to. It's that good. And then we have Evening Bloom. And the notes in this one is White Rose, Narcissus, White Orchid, and Vanilla. So they're based in vanilla and, you know, like sweetness, but they're still very, very, very floral heavy. So you do have to like floral scents um, to enjoy these, but they have other scents. I just love my home to smell fresh and clean and floral and luxe and beautiful, okay? So that's why I have these. I also have the diffuser. It is so pretty and so chic. I love the packaging. It smells divine. It matches my decor. It has the white labeling with the black writing. I just think it's so nice with the gold top here. It's literally perfect. And I love the fact that this scents up my entire downstairs. I am a huge Joe Malone diffuser type of girl, okay? p and Blush Suede is usually my home scent. This has replaced that, okay? I have this sitting over here on my credenza and I love it so much. So these diffusers that they have and these room sprays, these are definitely worth your coin. Of course, the candles are amazing as well, but you can get candles anywhere. These, they have outperformed some of the most luxurious brands that I've purchased at Saks and Nordstrom, okay? Just to let you know. Okay, so next up, I wanna move over to accessories. I have a pair of earrings here that you guys have been asking me about. I've worn them a few times and I also wore these in New York. They are by The Lav Style. <laughs> Every time I say that, y'all are thinking I'm saying lab and it's probably just the country accent, but it is The Lav style with a v and it says timeless jewelry um and their website is the lavstyle.com black owned woman owned business let me show you these hoops these are called the queen bee and that's literally the only reason why i bought them because i'm the queen bee hello um but these are the hoops these are absolutely gorgeous you guys they're pretty big they do have some weight to them these are made so well but they don't hurt my ears if you're not used to heavy earrings though i mean they may you know irritate you throughout the day i wouldn't say i would wear these from morning until night these are definitely like my nighttime going out type of earrings and i love that it's kind of like the old to like the door knocker but still very sleek and chic um just it's given around the way girl but elevated and i love that like these are everything and i love how they send them in this cute little package so it's easy for travel and just taking them with you these are 18 karat gold stainless steel and i also like the fact that these are hypoallergenic you don't have to worry about your ears um you know breaking out or anything like that and these are fairly priced 36 bucks you can't beat it with a stick they have a ton of other things on their website but this is what i loved and what i 
I had to pick up. And you guys ask me about these all the time. So that's why I wanted to mention these. I would definitely say this is definitely giving black girl luxury. So next up, we have to talk about sunglasses. You guys know I love sunglasses. Like I have a ton of sunglasses. My first pair of sunglasses are by the brand Alisa Johnson. You guys, I'm sure you know about her. This is Magic Johnson's daughter and she has a sunglass brand and her sunglasses are very luxe. Um, they are a nice price point. I did pick mine up on sale. I think they were $98 when I picked them up, but originally uh, most of her stuff runs about $136, $140. And these are my shades. You have seen me wear these. These are everything. I think these are called the Jane. I got the tortoise with the um, purple lens. Y'all, these are sick. Like, I'm, I'm speechless every time I put these on. Like, these shades are everything, okay? You need these. And she has this same style in, you know, different colors, different lenses. I just think these are so luxe. They're so nice. They are rivaling like Tom Ford, some of the bigger brands out there for a fraction of the cost. And I just think they are amazing, super heavy duty. They didn't skimp on the packaging. You get a nice soft case that still has some structure to it. Um, so you can throw this in your bag. I just love, okay, I'll definitely be getting another pair. These are worth the price and I love these so much very like sleek and also just the branding is very chic and sleek as well these are so good and i believe she named these after jane fonda which is one of her favorite actresses and i love jane fonda as well so yeah these are just a match made in heaven for me but i highly recommend you guys check out elisa johnson sunglasses they're everything now we can't talk about sunglasses without mentioning our favorite girl diera she is a youtube girly that has made a name and a brand for herself and i just love that so proud and she's a younger girl as well y'all all know diera she has her brand called lorve and I have these shades from her. Now, these are firecracker red, but they are a statement, okay? And these are really well made. She also has a pair of blue shades that look like this too, and I love them. But these, y'all, she really did something with these. These red shades are so nice, and they are definitely giving elevated black girl luxury. Like, I can't, I can't, I love these so much. So so she has so many different styles of sunglasses. I'm sure you'll find something that you love. And she always has the most fun and creative drops when she does drop new um, sunglasses. I love her marketing and how she like rolls everything out. So yeah, love to support another black owned woman owned business. Definitely check out Lorve. Oh, and we can't forget the packaging. So you get this soft case here and you also get a cloth case too so you know if this is too big for your handbag you can throw it in here and you're good to go and i believe everything that i have left here is going to be about handbags and i know you guys are excited so i'm going to start off with this first brand this is by anise and this brand actually reached out to me the last time i was in new york for fashion week and they wanted to send me a bag and i was so sad that i didn't get it in time to wear it to a show but this is the bag, y'all. It is this beautiful cobalt blue color. How unique and cute is this? Like, it's gorgeous. Real leather, okay? And look at the little handles on it. Like, how cute is that? Don't fret, though. It does come with a strap. I just took it off because it's easier to show you guys um, without it. But the handles, this strap, you can make this a crossbody bag and it just goes in these little handles like so. This bag is just so cute, it's so unique. And I just love how creative we are, you know what I mean? So they have a few different styles as well, but the craftsmanship of this handbag is absolutely amazing. Now this next bag, I don't think y'all are ready for it because it is a work of art. Seriously, but I actually knew about this brand previously just by way of like the internet Instagram It's called Florian London But when I was in New York a couple weeks ago I was able to actually see feel and you know, just really get my hands on the bags and y'all I fell in love with this brand black owned woman owned like I had no clue when I heard about Florian London I didn't know it was a black owned business Look at this bag Look at this bag, y'all. This is called the Anaya Clutch. And this is every single thing. It has like this alligator embossed leather. This is genuine leather. Uh, it has a top handle. 
look at like the clasp this is how it closes so unique so pretty i think this is such a gorgeous bag now this does put me in the mind frame of the hermes like longer clutch i forget the name of that one also um it reminds me a little bit of the bottega longer clutch but i love how they put their own spin on it and it's a substantial clutch like this is not just like oh giving dupe like this is well made y'all can you hear that? Like this is so good. So I just pulled it up on the website and I actually love the fact that it says fits an iPhone 15 Pro Max, card slot and additional pockets. Like it tells you the things, you know what I mean? Cause that's the main thing we're curious about. Does it fit my phone? And it does. So I'm gonna open this for you. I haven't worn this one yet. Even this key is so substantial and heavy. Like it has some weight to it. Uh, it is so beautiful. I'll definitely be ordering this in black. This was sent to me by the brand, but I love this clutch, y'all. Like, can't get enough, can't wait to wear it. It is so beautiful. I can't get over the embossed, like, leather. Like, this is so nice, and y'all know how much I live for a top handle. A clutch with a top handle, sign me up. It's so hard to find something like this. And like I said, yes, this does remind me of the Hermes clutch. It also kind of reminds me of the Bottega clutch, but are you getting either one of those for $300? No, you're not. No, you're not. You're paying thousands, and you're still getting genuine leather, like, immaculate craftsmanship, okay? <laughs> like... <laughs> I'm speechless. I'm speechless. I need this bag in black. I know they have it in black croc. They had this super bright like um, Balenciaga green neon um, in the croc. And then she also has like pebbled smooth leather and gold and a few different colors as well. She has so many different colorways in this gray, but it was the croc that called my name. I had to have it. Now, last but not least, I have three bags from this brand and the brand is called The Vault Label. I've shown this brown bag on the channel a couple of times and I also did a couple of uh, shorts reels with this and you guys fell in love. This is a genuine leather brown bag. This is when I was on the hunt for like my perfect brown bag. I think this is a really nice everyday brown bag. Um, it fits a ton in here. Really, really, really nice. You can see the craftsmanship is amazing. Now, I will say that this brand does a lot of dupes, but I like the fact that they are genuine leather and they don't skimp on the quality. Okay, that's super important. So this is a really good dupe if you like the Bottega style, but you don't really want to pay the Bottega price. I've spent my money with Bottega several times over. If you you guys have followed me you would know I have a couple of bags from Bottega I have shoes from Bottega like I love Bottega and I will splurge when necessary but sometimes they just have like a nice little everyday bag that I would like to have that I don't need to spend thousands and thousands of dollars for and I will say the leather on this is really nice now Bottega is known for their craftsmanship when it comes to that leather and that is something that I will always give them and will always spend that type of money on when it's something that I need and must have in my collection. This was not a must have in my collection. I was just on the hunt for like brown bags so I was buying brown bags from a lot of different places and I ended up loving this one okay. So this one is really cute. Love it so much and you can't beat it. Black owned, woman owned business. And I also have two brand new bags from the vault label. I don't know if these are out yet. I think she may have just released a date, but they may not be available just yet, okay? And these are them. Look at these bags, y'all. You already know what this is given. This is definitely given Mini Kelly. And if you know me, you know I love my luxury bags and I have an Hermes Kelly but it's not giving mini kelly okay and the price for a mini kelly is upwards of twenty five thousand dollars yeah don't sign me up for that don't sign me up for twenty five thousand dollar bag okay if i get another um hermes bag it's gonna have to be in the store or you know just a really nice deal i'm not paying twenty five thousand dollars for a bag okay but these when i saw these i was like girl i need these a sap and she ended up uh sending them to me right before fashion week and i didn't even get a chance to wear them but i did wear this one on valentine's day and this matches my red bean lip perfectly okay i did a little real short with that um but this bag look at the red like this is giving box leather okay just like my hermes kelly now of course it's not the exact same but to the naked eye you would never be able to tell like it is 
well made y'all this is a beautiful bag i love the fact that it has the top handle and it also comes with a strap now this black bag is a little bit more casual than the red because this is like box leather so it has that high shine and this one gives more swift leather i felt the swift leather from hermes and this feels quite similar i wouldn't say it's not as buttery soft but it's almost there okay it's really 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 nice um and like i said this was a little bit more casual this is why i have the strap on this one now this is not a crossbody strap that's the only thing i would change on that because i would love to carry this crossbody and of course you can wear her top handle i just love the silver hardware on these i don't know it just gives it like cool girl you know just trotting around with my little bag <laughs> and I just think these are so cute and I also like the fact that these are dupes not necessarily replicas because they don't have like any branding on them whatsoever um of course you know what it's trying to be but you really can't beat the quality sometimes like you find a dupe on amazon and the quality is just not there i can tell she takes her time and she really scours and finds like the best of the best and then she sells it to the customer so that's what i love most of all it's like the quality control of the business of course black owned that i want to support and woman owned so if you like these types of styles but you don't want to spend that money for it check out the vault label y'all and i don't know how long she she's going to be doing dupes because I do know that her goal is to, you know, kind of like create her own handbags, which I'm here to support that as well. But for now, you might want to go ahead and pick these up because these are immaculate. And last but not least, I just wanted to mention Brandon Blackwood. I absolutely love Brandon Blackwood's bags. If you've been following me for a while, you would know we've had several conversations surrounding Brandon Blackwood. Um, I have two, no, I have three of his trunks. I've had a little bit of a quality issue with two of them, but I'm still giving grace because this is an up and coming black um, designer that is really infiltrating the designer space. And, you know, I think that it's important to be able to give grace for growth. And I just love his bags. I think he has amazing bags. They're really unique. And I like that he is really making a stamp like with his own styles. You know what I mean? So I love that. He has a new drop coming out that I'm super excited about. So I think I'm going to chill on the trunks since I usually have issues with like the wear and tear on those on the corners. But he has these backpacks coming out and he also has this zebra bag coming out. Y'all, I'm going to insert some pictures. I'll be purchasing, okay? The, like, I really want the black backpack with the gold hardware, but then I saw he had a green one and I was like, green is my favorite color and everybody knows that. So yeah, it's gonna be difficult. I mean, he has so many good things dropping. I think the drop is March 1st. So coming up very, very, very soon. So yeah, I love Brandon Blackwood and definitely will be supporting. Um, and I will leave some of my favorites down below if I can. I don't know if this video will go up in time, but yeah. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video today and make no mistake, I use and love black owned businesses and brands all year round, just like my lipsticks, my candles, all the things. But I do like to make like a cure rated video just for that because sometimes you know I feel like we have to dig really deep to find those brands and I like to have it in one little place for you guys to come and just easily click on it so make sure to check out some of my previous videos where I'm showcasing black owned brands as well because I try to only talk about new things this time but yeah thank you guys again for watching make sure to check out the description box I'll have everything linked down below also thank you so much pound cake for sending me over some new lipsticks I will make sure to put my code on the screen so you guys can get some money off and i promise you if you are looking for the perfect red lip pound cake has you okay they have the perfect red lip shade for every single skin tone every single lip shade because that's super important when you're a black girl okay we don't talk about that enough so make sure to check out that description box i'll make sure to have everything linked down below for you guys give this video a thumbs up if you want more content like this and i will talk to you on my next one bye y'all